Hey everyone, it's Lexi. So in today's video, I'll be doing my bookshelf tour. So it's been probably around this time every year. I like to do a bookshelf tour. I haven't accumulated a lot of new books over this past year. I've been really good at narrowing down my TBR. So in terms of, you know, style it hasn't you know and layout it hasn't changed as much um but nevertheless i thought you guys would still enjoy it so um i'm really excited for this um just so you know my tripod doesn't go up very high and i do have extensions on my shelf so for like the really top shelves the angle isn't the best so just bear with me but once it gets past like the extension it's kind of you know fine after that so i apologize that you know you know it's kind of like you're looking up at it from a really weird angle i tried my best so i apologize for that um but yeah without further ado let's get started so this is the general layout of my bookshelf so i have this smaller one by the end of my bed and that's where i keep some of my series the bigger harry potter books and all that down here i also keep a few books above my bed such as the house editions of Harry Potter. As you can see, there are some cooking books, um, which I will go through, and then I also have my hardback editions of the house books, but I'm not gonna go through anything up here. It's not that too exciting. <laughs> and these are my main bookshelves. So they are organized kind of just where they fit and also kind of the arrangement of it. So here is where I kind of keep my series, um, as well as some of the bigger books that I own in addition to the bookshelves on the right side here, which I'll quickly go a bit closer. These are authors that I either have multiple, like I have many books by that author, or I just have like single books, so they're kind of mixed in um, here. And then on the smaller bookshelf is where I keep some of my mass market paperbacks and the paperbacks from when I was younger. The Assassin's Blade, Throne of Glass, Crown of Midnight, Air of Fire, Queen of Shadows, Empire of Storms, Tower of Dawn, Kingdom of Ash, A Court of Thorns and Roses, A Court of Mist and Fury, A Court of Wings and Ruin, A Court of Frost and Starlight, A Court of Thorns and Roses, The Collector's Edition, and House of Earth and Blood by Sarah J. Mass, Harry Potter, A Journey Through a History of Magic, Harry Potter, A History of Magic, The Illustrated Editions of Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, Chamber of Secrets, Prisoner of Azkaban, and Goblet of Fire, The Case of Beasts, Explore the Film Wizardry of Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, The Archive of Magic, The Film Wizardry of the Crimes of Grindelwald, Wizarding World, A Magical Yearbook, The Illustrated Editions of Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, and The Tales of Beetle the Bard, all by J.K. Rowling, Renegades, Arch Enemies, and Supernova by Marissa Meyer, The Diviners, Lair of Dreams, Before the Devil Breaks You, and The King of Crows by Libba Bray. The Winner's Curse, The Winner's Crime, and The Winner's Kiss by Marie Rutowski, Walk on Earth a Stranger, Like a River Glorious, and Into the Bright Unknown by Ray Carson, The Wit and Wisdom of Downton Abbey by Jessica Fellows, Beauty and the Beast, The Novelization, and Rick Steves' Pocket Guide for Barcelona. And on the bottom shelf below this, I first have... Blood Brothers, The Hollow, and The Pagan Stone by Nora Roberts. The Bad Beginning, The Reptile Room, The Wide Window, The Miserable Mill, The Osteray Academy, The Aristaz Elevator, The Vile Village, The Hostile Hospital, The Carnivorous Carnival, The Slippery Slope, The Grim Grotto, The Penultimate Peril, and The End, all by Lemony Snicket. First up on this shelf, I first have the box set of Harry Potter by J.K. Rowling, The Fault in Our Stars by John Green, The Strange and Beautiful Sorrows of Ava Lavender by Leslie Walton, Stronger by Jeff Bowman, Uprooted and Spinning Silver by Naomi Novik, Cathedral of the Sea by Eddie Fonzo Falcones, Rapunzel's Guide to All Things Brave, Creative, and Fun, Lost in a Book by Jennifer Donnelly, The Crown Volume 1, and The Crown Volume 2 by Robert Lacey, The Splendid and the Vile, and Dead Wake by Eric Larson, Where the Crawdad Sings by Delia Owens, Wonder Woman Warbringer, King of Scars, and Ninth House by Lee Bardugo, Sapiens, and Homo Dias by Yuval Noah Harari, Stars Above, Fairest, Cinder, Scarlet, Cress, 
and Winter by Marissa Meyer, The Kiss of Deception, The Heart of Betrayal, The Beauty of Darkness, Dance of Thieves, and Vow of Thieves by Mary E. Pearson, The Queen of the Tearling, The Invasion of the Tearling, and The Fate of the Tearling by Erica Johansson, The Bear and the Nightingale, The Girl in the Tower, and The Winter of the Witch by Catherine Arden, Heartless by Marissa Meyer, so the Hogwarts Library, including Quidditch Through the Ages, Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, and Tales of Beetle the Bard, Very Good Lives, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, The Chamber of Secrets, Prisoner of Azkaban, Goblet of Fire, Order of the Phoenix, The Half-Blood Prince, The Deathly Hallows, The Cursed Child, The Screenplay for Fantastic Beasts and Where to Find Them, The Screenplay for The Crimes of Grindelwald, The Cuckoo's Calling, The Silkworm, Career of Evil, and Lethal White, all by J.K. Rowling. The Bone Garden, Gravity, Harvest, Bloodstream, Life Support, The Surgeon, The Apprentice, The Sinner, The Keepsake, The Mephisito Club, Body Double, Vanish, Ice Cold, Girl Missing, The Silent Girl, Last to Die, Die Again, I Know a Secret, Playing with Fire, and The Shape of Night, all by Tess Gerritsen, Blood on the Tracks, Dead Stop, Ambush, and Gone to Darkness by Barbara Nicholas, Nine Elms, The Girl in the Ice, The Night Stalker, Dark Water, Last Breath, Cold Blood, and Deadly Secrets, all by Robert Reisenda, The Ballad of Songbirds and Snakes, The Hunger Games, Catching Fire, and Mockingjay by Suzanne Collins, Shadow and Bone, Siege and Storm, and Ruin and Rising by Lee Dugo, Dark Witch, Shadow Spell, and Blood Magic by Nora Roberts, Codename Verity, Rose Under Fire, and The Pearl Thief by Elizabeth Wine, Stolen Songbird, Hidden Huntress, and Warrior Witch by Danielle L. Jensen, A Great and Terrible Beauty, Rebel Angels, and The Sweet Far Thing by Libba Bray, I'd Tell You I'd Love You But Then I'd Have to Kill You, Cross My Heart and Hope to Spy, Don't Judge a Girl by Her Cover, Only the Good Spy Young, out of Sight, Out of Time, and United We Spy by Allie Carter, My Sister's Grave, Her Final Breath, In the Clearing, The Trapped Girl, Close to Home, A Steep Price, A Cold Trail, and The Eighth Sister by Robert Dagoni, Still Life, A Fatal Grace, A Rule Against Murder, The Cruelest Month, The Brutal Telling, Bury Your Dead, How the Light Gets In, the Nature of the Beast, and Kingdom of the Blind by Louise Penny, In the Woods by Tana French, Year One, and Of Blood and Bone by Nora Roberts, Stillhouse Lake, Kill Man Creek, Wolf Hunter River, and Bitter Falls by Rachel Kane, Enchanted Forest, Joanna's Christmas, Secret Garden, Lost Ocean, and Magical Jungle by Joanna Bashford, Harry Potter Coloring Book, Enchanted Forest, and The Secret Garden Artist Editions by Janet Bashford, Agent Carter, Operation Sin, The Art of Zootopia, Reputation Volume 1, and Volume 2, Make Way for Ducklings by Robert Mikowski, The 1989 World Tour Book, The Red Tour Book, and The Reputation Tour Book, Reputation by Taylor Swift, Downton Abbey, The Official Movie Companion, Magnolia Table by Joanna Gaines, Harry Potter Film Wizardry, Little Women, the official movie companion, Wonder Woman, the art of the film, Agent Carter Season 1 Declassified, Agent Carter Season 2 Declassified, Harry Potter Page to Screen, Quiet by Susan Kane, The Musician's Daughter by Suzanne Dunlap, Night by Ellie Wiesel, The Light Between Oceans by M. L. Stedman, The Winter People by Jennifer McManon, the Life We Bury by Alan Eskins, Still Alice by Lisa Genova, It Ends With Us by Colleen Hoover, Impossible by Nancy Whirlin, In A Dark Dark Wood by Ruth Ware, Sarah's Key by Tatiana de Rosnay, The Kitchen House by Kathleen Grimson, A Northern Light by Jennifer Donnelly, The Keeper of Secrets by Julie Thomas, The Actor's Life by Jenna Fisher, Yes Please by Amy Poehler, Seriously, I'm Kidding by Ellen DeGeneres, Scrappy Little Nobody by Anna Kendrick, Mind Platter by Najwa Zibin, 
The Silent Patient by Alex Michaelides, Long Bright River by Liz Moore, What Happened by Hillary Clinton, Becoming by Michelle Obama, All the Light We Cannot See by Anthony Dewar, Behind the Scenes at Downton Abbey, The World of Downton Abbey, and Downton Abbey A Celebration, Season of the Witch, Daughter of Chaos, and Path of Night by Sarah Reese Brennan, Pretty Girls by Karen Slaughter, The Baker's Secret by Stephen P. Kiernan, The Gerstery Literary and Potato Peel Society by Mary Ann Schaefer and Annie Barrows, The Book Thief by Margaret Zuzak, Orphan Train by Christina Baker Klein, The Help by Katherine Stockett, Emily and Einstein by Linda Francis Lee, Once We Were Brothers, Saving Sophie, Carolina's Twins, and The Trust by Ronald H. Bolson, Beartown, and Us Against You by Frederick Backman, The Alice Network, and The Huntress by Kate Quinn, Night Circus, and The Starless Sea by Aaron Morgenstern, A Good Marriage by Kimberly McCrite, The Vanishing Half by Britt Bennett, and The Beauty and Breaking by Michelle Harper, Me Before You by Jojo Moyes, Breath of Scandal, Mean Streak, and Friction by Sandra Brown, A Fall of Marigolds, and Secrets of a Charmed Life by Susan Mesoner, Me Before You, and The Girl You Left Behind by Jojo Moyes, The Things We Do for Love, Between Sisters, Night Road, Homefront, Firefly Lane, Fly Away, Winter Garden, The Great Alone, and The Nightingale by Kristen Hanna, Lilac Girls, and Lost Roses by Martha Hall Kelly, Sharp Objects, Dark Places, and Gone Girl by Gillian Flynn, The House at Riverton, The Lake House, The Forgotten Garden, The Secret Keeper, The Distant Hours, and The Clockmaker's Daughter by Kate Morton. In conclusion, Don't Worry About It, Someday Someday Maybe, and Talking As Fast As I Can by Lauren Graham, What Alice Forgot, Big Little Lies, and The Husband's Secret by Lane Moriarty, Leaving Time, and The Storyteller by Jody McCult, What She Left Behind by Ellen Marie Wiseman, Garden Spells, Lost Lake, The Peach Keeper, The Girl Who Chased the Moon, and First Frost by Sarah Addison Allen, The Devil in the White City, and In the Garden of Beasts by Eric Larson, Postmortem, Unnatural Exposure, All That Remains, Cruel and Unusual, The Body Farm, Point of Origin, The Last Precinct, Black Notice, From Potter's Field, Body of Evidence, and Cause of Death all by Patricia Cornwell, Grave Secrets, Deadly Decisions, Crossbones, Spider Bones, Bones to Ashes, Break No Bones, Deja Dead, Bare Bones, Devil Bones, Death Du Jour, 206 Bones, Monday Morning, Fatal Voyage, and Flash and Bones all by Kathy Reichs, Beethoven, Anastasia, City of Ember by Jeanne Dupro, Prince Caspian by C.S. Lewis, Lucky by Alice Seabold, The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe by C.S. Lewis, The Other Sister by S.T. Underhall, The Lovely Bones by Alice Seabold, The Perfect Man, My Sister's Keeper by Jodie Picoult, Misty by Misty May Trainer, A Dog Walks Into a Nursing Home by Sue Halpern, Just Listen by Sarah Dessen, The Art of Racing in the Rain by Garth Stein, a Dog's Purpose by W. Bruce Cameron, Inside a Dog by Alexandra Horowitz, The Field Guide, The Seeing Stone, Lucinda's Secret, The Ironwood Tree, The Wrath of Mulgraf, and The Notebook for Fantastical Observations by Tony Didalizzi and Holly Black, Les Miserables by Victor Hugo, and Then There Are None by Agatha Christie, The Perfect Husband, Live to Tell, and The Neighbor by Lisa Gardner, The Pact by Jody Bacolt, Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe by C.S. Lewis, and Charlotte's Web by E.B. White. The Binded Copy of The Chronicles of Narnia by C.S. Lewis, Secrets of My Hollywood Life, On Location, Family Affairs, Paparazzi Princess, Broadway Lights, and There's No Place Like Home by Jen Colatina, Elixir, Devoted, and True by Hilary Duff, the fossil trail so that's it guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know in the comments below how you like to lay out your books do you do color do you do it by theme do you do it by author i'm always curious because i love how see seeing how people disorganize their bookshelves i think it's just very interesting um so yeah thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys next time bye guys